In the preceding section, you monitored and controlled individual operands locally within a block. Using the global variable table, you can now also perform this on any other block and this way control the entire user program. An elegant method of preparing several test scenarios is the individual generation of different variable tables. These tables can be generated in the implementation phase and saved in the offline project. You have the option of commissioning individual machines, plant components, or also compiling individual variables for certain commissioning sections. This enables you to fix planned test processes in a reproducible manner. This table can later also be used for servicing and maintenance purposes. Insertable comments and the display of the symbolic names provide additional information on the individual operands. The display columns can be adjusted via the View menu. Additionally, you can also define conditions for reading and writing the variable values. In order to work with a variable table, we switch it online with the Monitor Variable button. Now you can monitor the status values of the listed global variables and define modify values. To do this, you enter the control value true and press the modify variable button. The signal change is directly displayed in the status value column, which in online mode displays the current signal status. An example will now show you how to combine the test functions variable table and program status in order to achieve the optimal overview in the testing phase. We activate the program status, which shows us the logic operation for operating a pump, and control the switch on via the variable table. The effects can be immediately observed in the program status. The pump output is activated. If against all expectations the pump switch is off, the missing conditions can be immediately recognized in the colorized signal flow.